Welcome to the Bee's Tales. Today, we have chosen a very light story for you. Past few weeks have been a little heavy, isn't it? Our learning about the independence and freedom struggle and uh, what was the other activity about friendships and the things that you can do and differences between people and yeah, it's been a little intense. So this week, the story is a very light story. The book is called Suddenly Cow. Yes, it's a story about a cow. It's also about a girl called Anu, but it is about a cow. Now, the book has been written by Saumya Rajendran and it has been edited by Samitha Gunjal. And there you see the little girl, her friends and the cow. The book has been published by Miss Muchi Books. Let's find out what is the story of suddenly cow. It was a boring day. Hmm, how could it not be? There was only upma for breakfast. Upma. I actually love upma, especially veg upma. Because you see, when that plate of food comes in front of me, you can see the nice creamy rava and then you can see the specks of mustard and little shiny shiny bits of onion and some carrot and some peas and some coriander leaves and that smell, mm, I love it. But our little Anu, she doesn't like it. She says, mm, it was a boring day because there was only upma for breakfast. You have to eat it up, said Amma. Even the green chilies. Now, Anu like to eat, like me, usually. But Upma? No, she didn't like it. Hmm. Amma stood there. She was watching the plate. And Anu had no choice. She had to eat the upma or else, but then suddenly a cow appeared and she seemed hungry. Mm. Now, Amma is a little scared. Did you see that? She was combing Anu's hair and where's the comb now? It went flying. Anu is also a little scared, but the cow doesn't seem scared at all. Amma gave the cow a banana. She didn't want it. Then Anu had an idea. Do you want Upma? The cow didn't answer her. But she ate the entire Upma up. She licked the plate clean. She even ate the green chilies. Anu is very happy now. Then Anu went to school. It was maths class. Everyone was yawning and Anu wanted to drink water. But Malithi teacher was very strict. There, doesn't she look strict? She was even stricter in person. And Anu is trying to drink some water. But Anu bent down and reached for her lunch basket. She took out her red water bottle and she was about to take a sip when Anu shouted Maliti teacher, what are you doing? Anu didn't know what to do. Suddenly the cow appeared. What do you want? Asked Malati teacher. The cow didn't say anything. Malati teacher was mad at the cow. She tried to hit the cow with her textbook. The cow moved to the board and started licking away all the sums on the board. Look at that. And who is laughing at this time? Is Malati teacher laughing? No, but there is somebody else who is laughing. The children were all having fun. 
But Malati teacher was furious. I will call the police, Malati teacher said. The cow didn't want any unpleasantness. So she left. And now let's continue the class, said Malati teacher. She had forgotten all about Anu. So Anu was saved from trouble again. Anu went home after school. There was no power at home. She couldn't watch TV. So she called Vinu and Venu. The twins, they were her neighbors. They came right away. Anu took out her bat and ball. And Vinu said, I want a bat. Venu said, no, I want a bat. They both fell on each other. And Anu said, no, no, please stop, don't fight. But nobody was listening. Suddenly, the cow appeared. Venu and Venu stopped fighting. They had never seen a cow before. They stopped fighting, but only for a second. Then they started again. Anu threw the ball towards the cow. Kick it back to me, she said. The cow didn't do anything of that sort. What's wrong with you? asked Anu. The cow said nothing. Then Anu thought, you must be hungry. And Anu and the cow went into the kitchen. And Amma saw the cow and Anu going to the kitchen. And she asked, what are you going to make? What do you think Anu made? Of course, she made Upma. <laughs> Did you like the story? Well, I really enjoyed telling you the story. Make sure that you like, share and comment on this video if you liked it. And subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so. By the way, I am told that there is a bell icon next to that subscription uh, link. So if you click on the bell icon, you will be able to get all the future notifications. Make sure you do that also. Okay? Alright then. See you next week. Bye-bye.